Great. Frank, happy birthday to you. And many more. All right, God bless. Papa Frank, what's up? Mike Bolo Jr. here. Heard you're turning 100. Happy birthday. Congratulations. Keep it rolling and go Irish. Frank, this is Lou Holtz. As a head football coach at Notre Dame for 11 years, it was a marvelous experience. But I've always been a Notre Dame fan because, see, in the late 40s, you graduated from Notre Dame in 1947 and then went on to become a doctor and you've changed many people's lives. But you know what's really amazing is the four years you were at Notre Dame, you didn't see him lose a football game. Well, you saw him tie a couple, but... When you had all the great athletes, you had Johnny Lujak, Sitko, Leon Hart, the list goes on and on. So it's such a special time to be part of Notre Dame. At that time, Notre Dame was all male. I asked Father Hesper once, why did you make Notre Dame co-educational? He said, if we were ever going to be a great academic institution, we cannot afford to eliminate one half the most talented people in this world, and that is the students, girls. That's why Notre Dame is now co-educational. I know you're a local physician for almost 60 years. You have six children, many, great ch many grandchildren, and some great-grandchildren. I see the lights of Paris, I see the lights of Rome, but the brightest lights in the world, Frank, and the tail lights, my grandchildren going home. Till the age of two, they're writing on walls, jumping on furniture, drove me crazy. But I want to tell you, nothing more important than family. I told many years ago, Frank, no matter what I accomplished this world, no matter how many championships I won, if I wasn't successful as a husband or father, I failed. One thing's obvious, you've been an ultra success in this world. To be able to turn 100 is really, truly amazing. I wish I knew the secret to your success. But thanks for the difference you've made in people's lives. And let's remember, that's the most important thing, making a difference in other people's lives. Let's hope that Notre Dame doesn't lose another football game for four years like happened in the late 40s. God bless you. Go Irish. Happy 100th birthday, Papa Frank. This is Lauren, Aaron and Phil's maid of honor. The same day that you were Phil's best man on January 2nd, 1982. I know we both treasure those two and so glad that we could be together on that day to celebrate that wonderful event. I hope to see you soon. Take care. Love, Lauren. Happy 100th birthday, Frank. Best wishes to you from Notre Dame. Frank, 100 years old. Happy birthday from Pipavacqua, the AD in Notre Dame. Go Irish, and that's congratulations on turning 100. Absolutely amazing. Frank, happy 100th birthday. I know time has traveled quickly for you, but I hope you have good memories of your time at Notre Dame. It's a special time of year. We just graduated another class, and uh, we have a little bit of break here. But uh, I hope that when you get a chance to come back to the campus with family and friends, that they can all celebrate your wonderful life and career. All best wishes to you, Frank, and happy birthday once again. Hi, it's Coach Ivy. Just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Hope you have a beautiful, blessed day. Um, happy birthday. Frank, happy 100th birthday. Happy, happy birthday. We're so grateful for your life. 